FCA has been such a great blessing to me, Dan. Um, I can't thank you know the program enough for everything it's done for me. It's given me lifelong friends and awesome like a Christian faith within my sports programs. Mm -hmm. How has that fit in? You know, as you compete and as you train, you know, just honoring God in the way that you the way you sweat. You know. Yeah. Um, for me, it's just you know always remembering that God's above everything else, and that you know no matter what the competition is, no matter you know how hard the training is, you know. That the end goal is, you know, always to get to heaven, and that's what we're we as Christians are called to do. Mm -hmm. You've taken advantage of a lot of things FCA has offered, including camp too. I mean, talk about just the the big picture, the the body of work that it's been for you. You know, as you stand here uh, uh, early in your senior year. Yeah, um, for me, going to camp, you know, having those um, different coaches, you know, offering different pers perspectives and um, giving great advice for like um, not just you know in the sports that you're doing, but also for your future, for like your relationship with Christ, you know, that's really important to me. So having that was awesome. Mm -hmm. As a guy who's kind of been there and done it, what's your encouragement to that, that, that freshman that's out there to, to get involved? Um, do whatever you can to get involved, really. Um, you know, take a leap of faith, you know, in everything you do, because um, you won't be able to do it forever, you know. So having this time right now in high school to, you know, go to FCA camps, come to FCA, like, it's awesome. So just take that leap of faith and just join, you know. Mm -hmm. How has all that spilled into just the regular course of your life as a student, walk in the hallways here? Do you think you're more mindful of Jesus because of that? Definitely. I always, um, you know, with FCA in the morning, especially on a Wednesday, I, I leave having a better day. I leave yeah. feeling, you know, more happy, you know, just going out and wanting to spread, you know, the gospel in my school. FCA has been wonderful to have in the school day. Like, it really just gives you a chance to be able to um, spread God's word throughout the school and just have a chance to be able to um, spread God light, God's light to others and just participate in something like that. Mm -hmm. Tell me how it's affected your life as an athlete, too, and your cheerleader, too, right? Yeah, I'm a cheerleader and a track runner, and it has really affected my viewpoint, and just to know that God's with me through everything that I do is really helpful when it comes to certain events and activities. Mm -hmm. Sometimes uh, the gospel um, comes through through someone's actions, not necessarily just the Bible. Is that something you try to be mindful of, I guess, as you do what you do? You know? Yeah, I'm very mindful of that. Like, I'm. It's very important to me to be able to spread uh, God's light to others and just be an example to others, just to know that they're not alone and be able to work with them to find God's uh, word as well. Mm -hmm. You are coming down the stretch here, too. There's a lot of fresh faces over there. What's your encouragement to those kids who walk in the hallway to say FCA is a, it could be a, a really good fit for you? Uh, my encouragement to the new people to FCA is just there's so much going on in the world right now just to remember to like bring something positive to school and be able to uh, be that example in the halls as you're going through and being able to uh, be that good example to people. Mm -hmm. How have you maintained the leadership role that sometimes you can get burned out on that? You know, a lot of kids look to you, especially in FCA, I think, to to kind of be that hammer of the faith too. Um, it's not really like about me. Like I think that having some sort of role as a leader is just being able to like help others and uh, be the person to step up and be able to um, help others find their way instead of trying to think about it as being in charge of someone else. Mm -hmm.